welcome. Thank you for tuning in. My name is Markus and today's class is for you. If you also sometimes get up in the morning and you feel that your body feels super stiff and you just want to move a little bit to get rid of this stiffness. Um, I kept this practice quite short and simple and we're also going to finish it with a little bit of a breath work to clear up the mind. I hope you enjoy the class and see you on the mat. We start seated, so either cross-legged or on your knees, whatever feels good. And then gently start by closing your eyes. Take a short moment to arrive on your mat, to arrive in your body. Slowly scanning through our body, feeling those tight spots that might feel a bit more stiff now in the morning. Bringing awareness to the breath. Also here, first start observing. And then you can start slowly bringing some movement into the spine. And we just want to move our rib cage from left to right. You can keep your eyes closed for this one, as you prefer. And then from the side to side movement, we switch to some small circles. Only moving the rib cage, bringing it forward to the side, back over to the other side. Small movements. Maybe with every round the movements become just a little bit bigger. Maybe at some point you're also integrating the lower back, drawing big circles with your spine. Coming forward, sticking the chest out, back, drawing everything in, rounding the spine. And then slowly let those circles become smaller again. Till you find all the way back towards the center. And then back in the center, we switch directions. First start small circles with the rib cage. Increasing the range a bit more with every round. And here you can try to move already with the breath, inhale coming forward and exhale back in forward x coming back and let those circles become smaller again we find all the way back towards the center making sure the spine is nice and upright now with your next inhale, take both arms overhead, reach them towards the ceiling. If your eyes are still closed, you can gently open them again, maybe looking um, slightly up towards the ceiling. And then let your palms face forward. And then with your next exhale, draw the shoulders, blades together, the elbows, and maybe even making a fist here. Exhale, draw in. Inhale, reaching up. And exhale, opening the chest. Inhale, reaching up. Exhale, draw it in. Two more times. In and exhale. Last time. Inhale, reaching up. Exhale, draw it in. Good. Inhale, taking the arms up. And then with your exhale, look in front, place both hands in front of the knees, and then roll over onto all fours. Bringing our knees underneath the um, hips, hands underneath the shoulders. And now keep your knees underneath your hips and then just walk your hands forward. Try to sink down with your chest and your chin towards the mat. And 
You can also come on to the fingertips if you want to come just a little bit deeper. And then if you're all the way down with your chest and with your chin, just lift this a little bit up again, still keeping the arms reaching forward. We take our right arm, reaching it through underneath the left one, placing our right shoulder, our right cheek down towards the mat. Left arm still reaches forward. Good. And then press into the left hand, the one that's still reaching forward, and then bring the right hand also back forward. We switch the sides. The left arm reaches through underneath over to the right. Left shoulder, left cheek down. Good. And then bring the left hand back forward and then slowly walk both hands underneath the shoulders. We tuck our toes under and we lift up into our first downward facing dog of today. Here you can walk the feet out a little bit, bending one knee after the other. Good. With your next inhale, lift your right leg up. Step the right foot in between your palms. Lower your left knee down. You can untuck the toes. Inhale, take both arms up into a low lunge. Then doing a similar thing as we just did. With your next exhale, again, cactus your arms. Bring the shoulder blades together. The elbows draw in. Open the chest. Inhale, reaching up. And exhale. Bring it in. In, reaching up. Exhale, open. One more time. In, up. Exhale, open. Take the arms back up. And then bring your left hand next to you towards the mat. Maybe even slightly out. And then the right arm is reaching all the way over the ear towards the left. Try to keep your right knee over the right ankle. Creating length in the right side of the body. And from here, roll in from your chest, place your right hand down, and then walk both hands towards the inside of your right foot. Now keep your left hand on the mat, the right hand comes on top of the right knee, and just gently push the right knee out to the side. You can come to the outside of your right foot, Rolling open from the chest. Good. We bring the right knee back in, placing the right hand back down, left toes tucked back under. We step back into our down dog. Inhale, taking the left foot up. Step the foot in between your palms. The right knee lowers down. Inhale, lift it back up. Low lunge. Inhale, reaching a little bit further up. And exhale again, drawing the elbows in, opening the chest. Inhale, reaching up. Exhale, open. Good. Inhale, reaching up. Exhale, open. Do this one more time. Inhale, reaching up and open good inhale reaching back up the right hand lowers down next to you towards the mat and the left arm reaches all the way over the ear towards the right But roll in from your shoulders, left hand lowers down, walking both hands back towards the inside of the foot, right hand stays, left hand on top of the knee, and then just gently press the knee out to the side, rolling open from the chest.
slowly you bring the left knee back in left hand lowers down we step back into down dog and with our next inhale we lift the right leg back up stepping the foot in between the palms this time we bring the back foot flat to 90 degrees toes point to the side and then roll it up warrior two on the right side having the front knee above the ankle heels in line We're slowly lengthening our front leg. We bring the, um, the front foot in, so our outside of the feet are parallel. Inhale, take the hands to the hips. And with your exhale, fold forward. And here you have two options. You can either bring your hands down underneath the shoulders, if you want. You can also take the opposite elbows. Just let everything hang forward. Maybe adding some bouncing movements. You can also draw some figure eights or infinity signs. Finding back to the center, if you added some movement, place your hands down, lift it halfway up. And then walk your hands towards the right front foot, both feet pivot forward. We step back into our down dog. Inhale, the left foot lifts. Step the foot in between your palms. Again, back foot opens flat to 90 degrees. Rolling up, warrior two on the left side. Slowly start by lengthening your front leg, pivot the front foot in. This time we take the hands behind, interlacing the fingers. And then first roll the chest open, shoulder blades roll back. Inhale and exhale. Again, folding forward, this time taking the hands with us, reaching them long overhead. Inhale, lift it halfway up. Release both hands again down underneath the shoulders. Walk your hands towards your left front foot and step back into down dog. Good. Next, inhale, rolling forward into plank. And then we can use the knees, chest, and chin to roll or to come all the way down onto our belly. And now, first, keep the hands next to your chest. And then, with your next inhale, Lift from the chest up and forward. Bring the shoulder blades together, the elbows a little bit closer in. And exhale, lower down. Two more times. Inhale, the chest is lifting. Exhale, lower down. Good, one more time. Inhale, lift. And exhale, lower down. Bringing both hands underneath the forehead, maybe moving the hips and the legs left, right. And then this time bringing both hands behind our back, again interlacing the fingers. Rolling the shoulders back, and with the inhale again, we lift from the chest as if somebody's pulling you in the hands, lifting you up. And then, if you want, also lift the feet off the ground. We release back down, also releasing the hands, maybe bringing them back underneath the forehead, moving the hips, the legs. Then we take our right arm forward, we roll over our right side, coming all the way onto our back, keeping both feet bent, knees are pointing up towards the ceiling. Arms are next to the body, 
with our next inhale, we roll ourselves up, lifting the hips, and at the same time, the arms lift and reach behind towards the mat. Exhale, lower the hips, lower the arms. Inhale, rolling up. And exhale, bring it down. Good. Inhale, lift. Exhale, lower. Two more times. Inhale, lift it. Reach the arms behind. Exhale, down. Last time we lift and reach behind. We stay up here, reaching the arms behind. And then slowly lowering the hips, lowering the arms back down. Good. Opening our feet just a little bit wider, maybe mat width. And then let your knees come from left to right. Good. Coming back to the center, bringing both feet back into the center. And then bring your right ankle on top of your left thigh. Take the right arm through the legs, left hand from around. Either hold on to your chin bone or behind your thigh. Lower the, the shoulders and your head back down while drawing the left knee in and the right knee opens to the side. Keep your right ankle on top of your left thigh, lower your left foot back down, and then bring your left foot just a little bit further out to the side. Both arms reach out like a T, and then both knees sink over to the right. And then you can look over to the left. Taking a simple twist. And lift your knees back towards the center, step the left foot in, release the right ankle down. Left ankle on top of your right thigh, the left arm reaches through, right in from around. And then pulling the right knee in, left knee opens, again release the head, the shoulders down. Keep the left ankle flexed and active. Keeping the left ankle on top of the thigh, right foot lowers down. And then step the right foot out to the side. Both knees sink over to the left. The arms reach out to either side. Bring both knees back in towards the center, right foot steps in, left ankle releases. Drawing both knees in towards the chest, make yourself small, round, maybe forehead to the knees. And then rock slowly back and forward till you find all the way into seated. So maybe now you're looking towards the back, you, know, you can again turn facing the front. And then find again a comfortable seated position. So maybe using a block or something with a bit of height underneath you. Can be again cross-legged or on your knees. We're finishing this morning practice with a bit of a breath work. Um, we're going to keep it simple. Just going to do a little bit of alternative nostril breathing. And how this is going to work is we're going to take our right hand. Um, we bring the index finger, middle finger in towards the palm. So our ring finger, pinky one and the thumb are still open. So we have the right thumb for the right nostril and the ring finger for the left nostril. So we can switch closing each nostril at a time. And as I said, we're going to keep it simple. So we're going to start inhaling through the left nostril on the count of four. Then we close the left, exhale right, inhale right, exhale left. I will be guiding you through this. So first find again comfortable, comfortable seated position. Keep your spine long. 
close your eyes. And then on the right hand, you can bring already the index finger, middle finger in. You can keep your eyes closed for this one. If you're doing it the first time and you want to see it again, you can also open them up to you. Good. And then take an inhale in, exhale through the nose. Take your right thumb to the right nostril, inhale through the left nostril for two, three, four. Close your left nostril, exhale through the right, two, three, four. Again, inhale right, two, three, four. Close the right, exhale left, two, three, four. Inhale left, two, three, four. Exhale right, two, three, four. Inhale right, two, three, four. Exhale left, two, three, four. Inhale left, two, three, four. Exhale right, two, three, four. Inhale right, two, three, four. Exhale left, two, three, four. Now adding two counts, inhale through the left, two, three, four, five, six. Exhale right, two, three, four, five, six. Inhale right, two, three, four, five, six. Exhale left, two, three, four, five, Six. Inhale left, two, three, four, five, six. Exhale right, two, three, four, five, six. Inhale right, two, three, four, five, six. Exhale left, two, three, four, five, six. One more round. Inhale left, two, three, four, five, six. Exhale right, two, three, four, five, six. Inhale right, two, three, four, five, six. Exhale left, two, three, four, five, six. Release your right hand down and then just inhale through the nose. Exhale through the nose. And bring up the palms together in front of your heart. Bow your forehead to the fingertips. And thank yourself. It took time for yourself in this morning to move your body, doing something good for yourself, for your body, for your mind. And then slowly lift your head back up. And then namaste. Thank you all for joining. Um, I hope you're feeling now fresh and awake. Body is maybe not as stiff anymore. And yeah, hope uh, you have a great day. See you soon. Thank you.